My name is Heather Nguyen and I'm here to talk about gender equity. I think in the last uh, 20 years um, we have made so much progress in gender equity and I, can, I think that we continue to do so um, in the very near future. In particular, I think there are two issues that um, I want to address. First of all is uh, how, to Im how to improve uh, access to education for women and girls and how to put more women in leadership positions. Access to education for women and girls is no longer just a social issue, it's become an economic issue. And I think mean, again and again, you can see the statistics have shown that improving access to education for women and girls can help increase GDP growth. And, and the solution is so much simpler than we think. Um, improving education access to women and girls can start it with uh, improve, giving them access to the internet. But giving women and girls access to the internet, you're giving them access to a wealth of knowledge at the minimal cost and without barriers. And also when uh, women and girls get access to the internet, they get connected to other women for sharing our best practices. And by doing that, you further enhance the skill to participate in the informal and formal economy. On the other spectrum, how do we get women to uh, participate in more leadership position? I personally believe that uh, in the power of mentorship. I mean, mentorship is so crucial for personal and career development overall, but even for women, it's, it's much more powerful because there's so few women leaders out there. Um, mentorship can help women to know that they're not alone in the workforce and also know that um, there's best practices out there that they can follow and help them propel in leadership positions. In summary, improving access to, uh, to education for women and girls and um, putting more women in leadership positions can help push us closer to the gender equity in the workplace.